International Journal of Health Policy and Management Quality and speed are our culture and the keys to our success. Welcome to the audio summary section of the International Journal of Health Policy and Management. Hello. The Benin Health System, like many low and middle income countries, faces several problems, among them structural problems and inefficiencies. That's why in 2012, the country has decided to use performance-based financing to address that problem. Two approaches were used. One was the uh, World Bank mainstream and the other the alternative developed through the Belgian Technical Cooperation Report. The aim of this article is to draw lessons learned from that approach that supports. Countries when implementing PBF should take into account their own and specific context. In terms of methods, we have used a theory-driven evaluation approach as well as mixed methods to collect, triangulate and analyze information. The theoretical model has been based on three mechanisms. Firstly, PBF as an instrument to support a comprehensive, sustainable and cost-effective approach to the district health system by using existing decentralized government structures, by using peer review as a verification mechanism for PBF, and using health services user platforms as counter-verification mechanism for PBF. Secondly, PBF as a way to increase health workers' motivation through a set of financial and non-financial incentives with regular coaching. And finally, PBF as a leverage to increase accountability towards demand-side actors and to support the autonomy of the population in line with the Dakar Declaration. This has resulted in three main outcomes. One, a, local, a stronger local health system, empowering various stakeholders involved in health, and reinforcing trust and dialogue between supply and demand side actors. Two, significant improvement in both technical and perceived quality of healthcare. And three, rather moderate utilization, moderate improvement in utilization of local health services due to remaining uh, financial barriers. Limitation of the BTC approach. Firstly, the independence of P verification may be questioned. Secondly, measuring technical quality of care leads to quite heavy me me uh, measurement processes. Thirdly, PBF is not yet totally integrated with other processes. This alternative model costs 0.59 euro per year per person compared to the, what is usually recommended of 2.8 euro per person. PBF as institutional and financial sustainability is at risk in Benin because authorities have not taken decision on uh, the post-donor program era uh, design. This experience testifies that PBF is not a uniform and rigid model. Countries should build their own uh, approach according to their specificities.